poker for a living. How freaking cool is that? Hey guys, I just got to my hotel room in Budapest, complimentary stay at a palace. And look at what I have over here. So now I'm gonna take you guys to some of my favorite places in one of the most beautiful cities in the world. And we start with the Christmas market. I am at the biggest Christmas market in Budapest and this cinnamon bun is an absolute must. So I am about to stuff my face and this wonderful gal that I met, she took a picture of me and she's actually recording me right now. She told me what it's called and I'm going to totally mess this up, we'll see. Kurdush Kalat. Say it. Kurdush Kalat. Kurdush so after stuffing my face, I needed to do a little exercise. And if you're looking to add a little glitz and glamour to your life, you have to visit the New York Cafe. It is ranked the most beautiful coffee house in the world. And in the 20th century, it was the most beloved coffee house in Budapest. It's where all the artists and, you know, cool people hung out. I definitely recommend trying the goulash. And with a full belly, it was time to hit a Budapest bathhouse. And I had no idea I was actually going to do this in Budapest. So look at I have my boots. <laughs> Everybody else is wearing flip flops and I have my ridiculous boots on. And if you're looking for a place to listen to some live music, grab a beer and some food, Ruin Pub is the spot. So now it's time to tell you what I learned about fear. Come along, now it's cold and we gotta talk about fear. <laughs> so I was so so scared to go on this trip by myself. I did meet my friend in Belgium, but besides that, I was on my own going to cities I have never been to where I don't know anyone. And I have never done something like this before. We get scared when we step outside of our comfort zone and we do something that we've never done before. And what I realized about fear is that with every city I went to, I got a little less scared. The night before I was supposed to go to Budapest, I wasn't scared anymore. And that's when I realized when you face your fear over and over and over again, at some point, you're not gonna be scared anymore. Fear is an illusion. It doesn't really exist. It only exists in our minds. Fear has two meanings, forget everything and run or face everything and rise. I choose to rise. Yeah.